Hey everybody, Greg here. Hey, I wanted to shoot a quick video for you to go over some of the features of Jungle Scout. It's a real powerful tool for product research, and I just wanted to make sure you're using it to its full potential. So as a lot of you know, um, of course you can just go to Amazon's main page, type in a, a search term here, and then hit the Jungle Scout favicon. And most of you are familiar with this feature, and you're probably using it quite a bit. So of course, after it extracts the results, don't forget that you can click on the category headers to sort all these items. So they're either sorted by alphabetical or numerical order. So you know, if I'm on this page and I want to figure out uh, which items are selling the, the most of them, I can either click on, on uh, sales rank and sort lowest to highest. So this one right here, yes for all, it has the lowest sales rank, which means it's selling the most products. Or I can click on estimated sales here. If you want another page with the results, you can click the Extract Results button down here in the bottom left. What this is doing is it's going into the second search page on Amazon. So if I were to scroll down here and click this page too, it's going into that second page and extracting all these same results from that page. And then of course, after you have all those extracted, you can again sort by uh, any comment that you'd like. So most of you are pretty familiar with those. Let's go into um, one of the product pages here so I can show you some more features. Once I'm in a product page, again, I can click the JS favicon. The results that were shown here, the top one is going to be the actual product page that we're looking at. So as you can see, those yoga accessories uh, gives you the price, of course, all this information, as well as um, extracting results from these items down here. Customers who bought this item also bought and then the sponsored ads. If you want to spy on other sellers or other brands to see what they're selling, selling, you can go into either the brand page which is found up here underneath the, uh, the product name or you can go into the sellers page by clicking on the sellers name right here. And these aren't necessarily going to be same name in this particular example they are but that's not always the case this seller could have multiple different brands so I want to click on this brand again I can extract results from this page and this is a great way to spy on this brand and see what other items are successful for this brand so for instance if I was already selling yoga mats and I was thinking about um, expanding my line adding some other products to it I might go to this page, uh, extract all the results, and then sort by, say, rank. And now I can see exactly what else this brand is selling that's selling well. So I could go down, I could click on some of these. It looks like um, their second best seller is a Mexican yoga blanket. So if I was already selling a yoga mat or yoga block or so on, I wanted to add to my label, uh, I'd probably look into selling a Mexican yoga blanket. Or you can just look through these, get some other ideas, get the creative juices flowing. So if I go back here and I go into the sellers page right here, sold by, I click this, Jungle Scout can extract results from this page. So once again, I've got all the items from this page. I can extract results from the next page. And then of course you can uh, sort these by whatever column you prefer. You can also go into the seller storefront by clicking on this link in the upper left hand corner of the window. And then this, these are, uh, should be all the, the same items that you find on this previous page, but actually I prefer the storefront page a little better. Um, it seems like Amazon sorts this page kind of by what's selling the best as opposed to, I can't really figure out how they're sorting uh, the items on this page. So actually, I prefer to go into this storefront page and extract results from here. So again, if I wanted to spy on other sellers, see what else is working well for this seller, I'd go into their page here. And remember, this isn't necessarily gonna be the Yoga Accessories brand. This could be any brand, because this is everything that this seller is selling. And that's obvious when we go, when we extract these results, we'll sort by estimated sales when it's done. And it looks like their fourth best selling item here 
is actually these traction cleats. So that goes to show you know they're not all in that Yogi Accessories brand. It looks like they have another brand called Yak Tracks that um, they're selling these uh, traction cleats in. So you know if I uh, was looking for a new line or new items to private label or sell, you know I, I'd probably click into this and then I would continue doing product research in here. So you know then you could you get led onto this page. Again, you can extract results from this page. And then you might see that this actually isn't the best type, the best selling type of uh, traction cleat. One of these down here is selling better. So you might see that maybe, you know, this orange one down here is selling even better. So now I'll click to that and then I'll move on to that page. And then of course, don't forget about the export to CSV file. Um, this is a great way if you want to save results, come back a week later, see how they've changed. Um, the export file now has a date and timestamp built right into it, so it's really easy to see what day had those results and so on. So I hope this helps you a little bit. I hope you're getting the most out of Jungle Scout, and I hope you are crushing it in your Amazon FBA businesses. Talk to you later.